So it's going fun back to us today. Got a really, really quick double battle video I want to do. So I know there's like 500 tabs open. I know I'm going to go crazy here. But yeah, so let's go. Um, of course, though, yeah, we did get some new. We got a lot of new info, by the way. Um, we got Kagembu Goku. I forgot to go for his teaser yesterday. So just a pretty quick teaser right there. Also, we did actually get a teaser for... Wrong one. Enter 13. So yeah, um, I kind of just opened them on Twitter anyway. So um, it was on Twitter time. So I was like, I think like some women actually took it out. So yeah, that's kind of cool. I still love his like stuff. Like he has it like still organized and like everything. <laughs> of course, though. And of course, we are getting new April Fool's Dome. We are getting, um, of course, Enter 13. He is coming to Global. He should be around, I want to say, like a day or two. Um, around the same time. Because Jennifer Jeffy's going to get their Kyle Campbell Goku info tonight. Um, so I mean, Data Diamond tonight. Let's do have a Data Diamond though, of course, for um, JP. So yeah, we have a new April Fool's Boma coming. I'm going to show it off right here. So yeah, we do have a new April Fool's Boma. She actually is coming. I thought I said boomers right there. I was about to be like, oh crap. I was like, man, joke card of the year. Like, the joke card of the century of Doken right here. We're seeing a baseball yomp show. But I was like, oh, 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 oh. I was like, bro, boomers. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Thank you, Google Translate. Like, you're so good. Google Translate. Like, Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, of course. But, um, yeah, cool. Uh, but yeah, though, of course, eh? We did get bonus info over here. Of course, so yeah, she's a Dragon Ball Secrets category. She was four. Everything got 41%. Typical stuff. I mean, it's April Fool's Day cards. They always do this no matter what. Like, I know April Goku, they did the G No, it was um the April Fool's card. Like, where we had, like, you know, all the white foods in the card. We had Bomba, my, I think we had, like, um, Injury 18, Pan. It's like trying to represent all the white foods in Goku. And I was like, first of all, first of all, Pan ain't no white food. Bola ain't no white food because they're Pan is older. She's like, what, 12? And like, um, what was like, what, 12? I mean, 12, like 11, 10 around that time? Oh, uh, she just looks old. She just looks older. Her parents looks older. Um, for all we know, she's younger, probably. So, yeah. Um, yeah, though, so yeah, um, she causes supreme damage, raises defense, um, attack and defense for 44, for 41% for four turns. So, well, that's good. Um, attack defense plus 41%. I actually evading enemies' attack, including super attack, plus additional attack and defense plus 50, um, plus 81%. Um, and key plus nine, um, when there's an, um, ally who has Goku's youth in the same turn. So basically, if you have a Goku's youth attack in the same turn, she's gonna be good there, of course. And her link are poor shocking speed. <laughs> nice, 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 nice there. Nice job there. Um, I got the, it got a, oh, you know, it got a buff right there. <laughs> it could be the buff. <laughs> no jokes. Okay. okay. Um, yeah, money, money, money. Um, Brainiacs, Incredible Adventure, Guys of Dragon Balls, and Scientists. Of course, the categories are Pepe Gals, Dragon Ball Seekers, Youth, and Dragon Ball Saga. Good categories, they all need a buff. Pepe Gals is pretty really okay. Dragon Ball Seekers, already good free play game, though. Um, Youth really badly needed, but she didn't even pretty good free play game, though. I mean, nowadays, there's a lot of free play games. I did see actually her, um, SA animations, all her assets, like her whole body, like, is a separate, her uh, SA animation, like, her whole body is like an asset, and like, yeah, you know why? I was like, ugh. <laughs> of course, though, yeah, she basically is, you know, well, one unit, you know, eight, one, because, you know, Goku and stuff like that, of course, you know, Goku cards, and Gohan cards, any Goku or Gohan cards, they do, like, five, eight. Of course, so yeah. Also, I want to say, what was this one? This was on Magic the Story event. We are getting this is new. Um, yeah, so basically, this is a new whole new story event, by the way. I'm um, coming to Global as well. So yeah, we can farm out and use. Um, this is an asset for Super Saiyan um, Spirit Bomb and Dwarf Goku. And of course, it's on Magic the teaser. Um, but yeah, this is the Android 13 overall and everything like that. It is him. This is how it's going to be structured. He's he's a target go target Goku and of course Android category um, team. Of course, he kind of lets that. But they didn't really change that much either. For Wobo and JP, they just teased him on Twitter and stuff like that. So yeah, he has a next Dark coming. A lot of people wanted Super Saiyan 2 Angel Goku. It transforms into Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku and Tech Majin Vegeta. Uh, Tech Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, they transforms into Majin Vegeta. Um, I feel like they're, gonna, they're, not, they're not gonna change that banner either, because like it's gonna be like a Joe Dragon Fest banner. Because every time you're April and May, they always seem to do stuff like this. But yeah, that means Goku Day, we're gonna get, because they know it's forever on the Zorb Goku. Because it'll come probably in about a week's time around this, so yeah, we should be seeing him probably about a few more weeks for Global, and plus your FAA missions and stuff like that, of course. Um, but yeah, though, I mean, that's cool. I mean, he's just coming to Global, so that's great. Um, a lot of people really want it, again, the Goku and Vegeta to come to Global first, because you know, Goku Day and stuff like that. So yeah, yeah I guess they're gonna be the next Goku Fest for Global. He did transform, I guess, when we have like, yeah, I get it. Uh, I guess, even though it's the transformation right there, even though I totally said I guess. 
So, but of course, though, yeah, he does, um, he does kind of form where you have about two or more, um, extra category odds in your team, which shouldn't be that hard after five turns to start battle. So basically, yeah, if you don't have to raise after five turns. Um, but yeah, I mean, overall, I mean, you're gonna have that. So basically, you want to run, you want to run, you want to run with extra category means, of course, um, Target Goku. It's just, they're the same category. Target Goku essentially is Android mixed up. So yeah, even though some awesome and Goku Butt should be on that freaking category because he doesn't also want to target, he specifically target Goku. He switched bottles with Goku, he could specifically target Goku. In the future trunks, he said, oh, Goku's mine. Paul is there, though, but still. <laughs> but yeah. I know supposed to be getting, like, um, this is old kids of all everything. Yeah, he does be targeting Goku, which you're never met someone for this man. Like, you're not, you're not gonna find him. Like, I agree with truth. I agree with Goresh. Everybody, not someone for his man. Do not summon. Don't summon. Wait. Do not summon him for his guy. Please save him for the anniversary. Do not summon. I don't care. His banner's bad. But don't, it's not bad, but still, like, don't summon him. So of course, I know we have a, like, a new free play trunks right here. Not free play, but we have a new trunks right here, actually. Um, but yeah, though, um, he has some new summon with William, of course. He really is good as well. He's gonna take, you know, damage for after, you know, do a super attack and stuff like that. And I know he, you can barely, I know he has, like, guaranteed crit and stuff like that as well. So let's say you get more gifts of him and stuff like that, because you're gonna end up, end up pulling, him, keep pulling him in the future anyway. So, um, yeah, he's gonna be good and stuff like that, of course. Um, for, like, you know, additional and stuff like that. Of course, we have some new assets right here as well. Um, I kind of go over here, like, for Jiren and himself. Um, Sales nails are actually black now. Of course, Jiren, like, he has a little Terran right there. Um, so we should see, um, like, you know, update for, updating for assets. They haven't done this before, like, updating assets. Boma has her own orb. She actually does have her own orb, by the way. Just new for Boma. Um, that's her own orb and everything like that. So, yeah, she is going to be the Ember 4 day card, of course. And this overall Android 13. Your full stats and everything like that. And I know we're going to be, I know we're supposed to be getting a new free to play unit as well. Um, but this guy right here, like this, um, you get him from a story event and stuff like that. So yeah, they are a new free to play unit. Android 13, 14. Um, so yeah, 13, 14, 14, and 15. I, I really messed up though. Um, but yeah, they are really good though. They're really good, like support that unit for you know, um, they're really support that unit, but um, they kind of can be. They are free to play unit though. They um, you can do them from a new story event that's coming up soon. So that's quite cool and everything like that. Of course, so we should be seeing that come up sooner or later because it's gonna drop the same time. Though, so I'm just also, there's Android um, 13 right here. Also, gives a Dokken Awakening. He's a free play unit. But you get from like the Bottle Shop and stuff like that. So, yeah, he's a STR free play unit. He really is a good solid unit, though. But of course, so uh, he's mainly really good to go through, you know, and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, this is all we want to go, really want to go with today. We have Android 13 coming to Global. We have, um, you know, Boma, a new Boma coming to, um, you know, JP Cyber, both Boba and JP is going to be from both versions, by the way. All of those is animations, you know, get the chips. Um, but yeah, that's all I just really want to go with today. Um, I do want to mention this as well. This is going to be in the store event right here. Um, also want to mention down here as well, like, we're going to probably get AGL Super Vegito's, um, these ain't probably in FO. We're going to get these guys probably get their awakenings for us on Global as well, not first, but, you know, we're going to get their awakenings and stuff like that. Well, I know it's going to come up. For these guys, we're going to get their ETA as well. And we're gonna go. Probably not going to get an area, because we just literally just had one. But, uh, again, those probably going to come back. You know, week's time we're gonna get Vegeta's and like that. I know we're gonna get Trunks. Um, don't ignore the World Tournament. I know we're gonna definitely get these guys next. Like, these don't confess guys, we're gonna definitely get them next. So, you know, like if the events stuff like that are gonna change, like, right, um, later on, stuff like that, of course. But again, though, the power of doing Nick Dokken Fest and Global after Android 13. Again, though, skip his banner. It's horrible. Please, don't do it. Just uh, take my advice and just skip them. Please skip them. But yeah, again, that's all you're going to say. We had a JP Dad download, of course. We had that. We had, you know, lots of new units and stuff like that. Um, so thanks for all the translation from Gorilla. He actually translate everything. So yeah, all we want, really want to go today. Um, for the video went a little bit longer than I thought. But yeah, see you guys later. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great life. Oh, good job. <laughs> so yeah, see you guys later though. Peace out.